Hi, my name is Paul Kaharvitz, and today we're going to be talking about the DynaClean conveyor. A DynaClean conveyor is designed primarily for pharmaceutical applications and for food producers. Uh, in this particular case, uh, we're going to convey bag powder. The customer wanted assurance that if uh, there was metal in the product inadvertently, that the metal detector here would sense it and then we would reject the bad one backwards off the end of the conveyor. I'll explain more about that just a little bit later. But when you put a, a 400 pound metal detector onto a, a conveyor, you have to build a very robust stand and that's exactly what we did here. Additionally, there has to be a metal freeze zone. So we had to come about 12 inches back on both sides of the metal detector. When we did that, we had to send the belt down below the metal detector and then loop back in. Let's take a look at the chute and what that does. First of all, I, I should go back a step and say that we are in fact counting each bag as it comes out with a, a light curtain that, that shines a wide beam across inside the chute. So as parts go past, it counts them. Like I said before, if metal is detected, we tell the pneumatic cylinders here to contract and it pulls up a chute right through here. And there, therefore it takes the product, catches it and rejects it backwards. As soon as that product is out of the way, that slide goes back and the good parts come out the end. As the light curtain counts, once we hit the set point, uh, the boxes have to move. So let's say the set point is 100. Well, when the 100th parts comes through, the boxes shift, but we have to at that point shut this door, even though they're good parts and accumulate them until a fresh empty box is down below it. Lastly, because we were using metal detection, we had to go to a DC motor as not to throw any signals in, in the way that might confuse the metal detector. But again, we coupled an oriental motor with a brother gear head and, and run a DC package up here. If you have any questions at all concerning this system, uh, please give us a call here directly at Dynamic Conveyor Corporation. Thank you.